Hi everyone, this is Jupiter Jim from jupiterjim.com and I'm here today to show you how to create a portfolio page. Uh, before I do that, I just want to go over a few of the basics. I'm at the themity.com website and themity.com is owned by two awesome developers, Matt and Mark Hodder, two brothers in Canada that create skins and child teams for Genesis and Thesis. Okay, let me just show you the skin or child theme that I'm going to be working for today. This skin is stage two. That's the one I'm going to be working with. And here's the demo site that I'm working with right now. It's called Spencer Rutledge. And it's for a photographer, Spencer Rutledge. Com. You can find his work once this is completed. Okay, so let me take you to Digital Painter. This is a portfolio page that's on the SpencerRutledge.com website. Okay, we're going to create another portfolio page, but before I do that, let me just show you. Here's an example of an item, a portfolio item that's on the portfolio page. It's called magazine cover. You can add an image in here, one image, 10 images, 100 images, it doesn't matter. Um, but there it is, there's one, and that's how you, each one of these is called a portfolio item. So I'm gonna create a portfolio page and it's gonna have items for beaches. So I'm gonna call the page beaches, Florida beaches, and the items, I'm just gonna add three portfolio items to that page. Um, and they're going to be scenes from Florida beaches. Okay, now let me open up my PowerPoint here. These are the steps that we're going to go over. And once you go over these steps and master these steps, you're going to be able to create a portfolio page that will show whichever category of pictures you want it to show. So step number one is to create the portfolio category called Florida beaches. You're going to call it whatever category you want, of course. Step number two, I'm just going to create three portfolio items and I'm going to add them to the Florida beaches category. Step number three, I'm going to create a page called Florida beaches, just a regular WordPress static page called Florida beaches. Then while I'm on that page in the dashboard, I'm going to choose custom template and the name of the template is going to be portfolio. Once that's done, I'm going to have portfolio options to choose from. I'm going to choose the category obviously called Florida Beaches. I'm then going to publish this page, add it to the navigation menu, and I'm done. It's that simple. To get our bearings, we're right back here at the Spencer Rutledge website, which is using the Stage 2 skin in Thesis 2.1. And what I'm about to teach you will probably work with any skin created by the Hotter Brothers at Themity.com. And it will probably work with any Genesis child themes as well. So let me get started. Let's go to the dashboard right here. Step number one, we're going to create a portfolio category called Florida Beaches. Okay, don't get intimidated with all this other stuff. You really don't need to finish, fill out that to make it happen. Just click Add New Category, scroll to the top, and that category has been created. There it is. Step number two, we're going to create three portfolio items. So we're going to go to Portfolio. We're going to click Add New, or let's go to Portfolio. These are the items that are already created. Let's just add three new ones. I'm going to call this Laptop on a Beach. Laptop on the beach. Okay, I'm going to click Save Draft. I'm going to just type in here. You can put in whatever you want. Here's my lap top. Spelling is messed up. It doesn't matter. I'll scroll down here. I'm going to add it to the Florida Beaches category. I also need to add a featured image. So let me click. Now I've already added these beach pictures to the media library. Um, so here's the one with the laptop on the beach. So I'm just going to click set featured image. Okay, I'm going to scroll up here, click publish. We are done with portfolio item number one. Now we're going to add two more. I'm just going to call it palm trees on the beach. I'm going to click save draft. Now this right here is from an Enviro gallery. That's a paid gallery I added 
to this skin. It has nothing to do whatsoever with this tutorial, and we're not even using it. It doesn't affect the portfolio page or anything. That's completely irrelevant, so don't freak out if you don't have that in your um, dashboard. Okay, here's the palm trees. Type some text in there. Once again, we're just going to add it to the Florida Beaches Portfolio category. We're going to add a or set a featured image. I've already added these images, like I said earlier. We're just going to set the featured image. Scroll up. Click on Publish. And now we've just created our second portfolio item. Let's create the last one. And we'll just call this blue waves. I don't know what to call it. So blue waves and save draft. Nice waves. Um, scroll down here. We're going to add that to the Florida beaches category. We're going to add the featured image. You can add set a featured image from your hard drive on your computer or you can just take it from an image that's already in the uh, media library. I added them uh, up there it is right there bing da bing da boom and that's done we're gonna click publish so we've already just completed steps one step two which is creating three portfolio items now we're going to create a page called Florida Beaches just add new Florida beaches and don't put any text or anything in there and we're gonna scroll down here custom template we want the portfolio template very simple very easy scroll up here the category we want is surprise surprise Florida beaches scroll up here and click publish and you are done Okay, now I'm going to add that page to the menus just to make it easier to find. I'm going to make it a submenu. Um, there it is, Florida Beaches. We're going to add it to the menu. Scroll down. Um, there's Florida Beaches. I'm going to put that under, I guess, under Digital Painter since that's a portfolio page and this is another portfolio page under that. We are going to save the menu. I'm going to go back to um, just the home page. Now I'm going to mouse under Digital Painter, click on the Florida Beaches page, and there it is. Those three portfolio items, we created them, we added them to the Florida Beaches category, so they're the only images that will show up on this page. Um, I can go back here, um, go to the page, I can go to Florida Beaches page, I can instead of the Florida Beaches category only showing portfolio items that have that category attached to them, I can just publish images that are in the business category so let's watch how that changes so it's still the Florida Beaches page same title and everything else but when I hit refresh we're gonna have some different portfolio items show up there and just like I said a different set of portfolio images showed up and that's all there is to it I hope that helped take care and have a great day